Is Washington now better off with Cousins or with Smith? No, they're not better off. They're not better off with Smith. I think they would have been better off with Cousins because he's a familiar face. He's thrown for over 4,000 yards over the last three seasons. Uh, it's not to speak glowingly about Kirk Cousins because, as far as I'm concerned, he's not a winner either. He's just he's not a loser, but he's not a winner. Uh, but the same could be said for Alex Smith. As far as I'm concerned, you're getting more of the same. Alex Smith doesn't turn over the football nearly as much. We might get that reality. Uh, but the fact is, he's not a game changer. He's a game manager. And one could look at Kirk Cousins in the same light. And so as far as I'm concerned, it's, 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 it's one or the other. It doesn't really make much of a difference to me. Alex Smith doesn't have me expecting anything different from the Redskins for this upcoming season. I can tell you that much. Theoretically, they should be better with Alex Smith because, Stephen A., you're right, they're more or less the same. You know, six one half dozen the other. You would hope neither one would prevent a good team from winning a Super Bowl, but you wouldn't expect either one to put a good team over the top in order to win it. You can read the run, you can run the read option with either guy. Alex Smith started taking more shots down the field this year. He's shown the ability to do it at times. They're almost a wash. The difference is Alex Smith is a lot cheaper. That's why they made this move. They could sign. They didn't have to see you know, Kirk Cousins at 35 million. Two years of a tag at this point is Alex Smith's entire 70 million dollar guarantee. So theoretically, you're better off with Alex Smith because since he's cheaper, those resources, the money you don't have to pay the quarterback, can be funneled elsewhere. The problem is it's only theoretical because that's assuming that the franchise knows what to do with the money. And has Washington ever given you the sense that they know what to do with the money? That's fair. Stephen A. Quickly. Uh the last time Andrew Reid traded a quarterback to the Redskins, it was a 33-year-old, just like Alex Smith, but it was Donovan McNabb, and it didn't end well. Why should Redskins fans think it's going to be different this time around? Beats me. I totally agree with you. Why should they think it's going to be any different, <laughs> anything different any time around? I mean, other than what Max pointed out, the fact that it's going to save Daniel Snyder and the Redskins a little cash, what else is there to say? I mean, the fact of the matter is there's no reason to expect anything different or anything better for Alex Smith than it did for Kirk Cousins. So my answer to your question would be, beats me. I have no idea. Yeah. It's a lateral move that they made to save some dough, and they won't know what to do with the dough. So, like, all fans of the other teams in the NFC East, as usual, oh, thank you, Washington's in our division.